Hello everyone and welcome back to another catalog walkthrough. I know it's hard to believe that we're already in the third one for this year. So this is the upcoming uh, May-June catalog and we will have a quick walkthrough uh, about some of the uh, new things that are in here. And while I have just a few samples for you to show right now, everything else is on the way. Just um, we might do some more uh, more detailed uh, videos about some of the new stuff once I get it here. Okay, so let's get started. So remember, this is the last two month catalog. Close to my heart will change in July to a three months catalog. And I have explained in the past uh, why the change was made and um, I still got a few questions about why and uh, you know the everything behind the scenes so if you're interested in that um, leave me a comment below here uh, and I will see that I maybe give you a little bit more background information about why it is changing what this means for you as well as what it means for us as makers and um how we go forward with this also when the new core catalog is coming out so which is um coming up as well so just leave me below a little information uh, comment and i will get to that at a later point okay but let's get started so as you can see up front here this is one of the papers in the new book and i just love this layout that's great you can also make this into a card i think that's just a neat idea to use some of your scrap papers okay and as always we start out with a little uh introduction and a little word from jeanette our founder uh great lady so um if you're not familiar with her just give it a little read then um here's some information about becoming a maker if you have questions to that and would like to join my team just contact me and then this one is for customers it's called a vip program and it is really great if you're ordering on a more regular base even if it's every two months or so um this is a great way to get extras and to get a few extra perks out of the whole system so if you're interested in that let me know all right then we have our subscription programs here are the new layouts so this is subscription pro subscription program is a four month or a 12 month program and you get every four months a box which contains two double page layout for each month so this would be may june july and august and you make each of these they're already pre-cut embellishments everything is in there you really have to just drop in your photos put your journaling in and you're good to go this being said, you naturally can always um, upgrade them with a little bit shimmer trim, a little bit glitter paper, some splashes here, maybe add an extra photo or two, or you use the kit and just rearrange this completely so it fits your agenda. Whatever works for you, this is a great way to get a lot of pictures done and pages done all the way throughout the year. And it's two double page layouts per month. And I think we all can scoop out some time to just do those. Then this is our um, card making subscription. And again here every um, four months or 12 months. So you can either sign up for the whole package. You pay up front for either of these. That includes free shipping. So you save extra. Um, or you choose the four months. So then you get billed every four months. All right. And here is some really crazy paper. It's called Fresh Paint. And it is retro, it is bright, it is, I know not everybody's, <laughs> everybody's cup of tea, but um, these are fun uh, papers and I know they're bright and I know they're really um, hitting, yeah, the screen factor. <laughs> um, I had to say when I saw them the first time, I'm like, oh my God, seriously. But um, when you look, at them in detail they're actually pretty cool so let me get you and show you because i have this one already here so this is a sticker sheet and like always nice thick stickers um you can color them in there is a lot of little phrases here which is nice these ones make great 
um, titles on your pages. And then, like I said, these are just really cool little icons you can put on anything. And then, I know, this is bright, but believe me, it's cool. So we have this checkerboard, and I will turn it around so your the camera is not um, going stir crazy. Um, so here we have some phrases. Here we have the checkerboard, and you have this cool um, zip strip on top. Then this one here, for example, this is actually a great paper to do a background um, either way. So um, this is something for every day for everyone. It doesn't have to be for the younger folks or the young at heart. Um, here's happy happy. You can cut this apart. And this is the back side of it. This one again could be a great background uh, for a layout. And you get two of each. So this is nice. Here we have some hearts. And again this one is multi-purpose. It is very busy, so if you um, decide to use this on a paper, on a layout, or on a card, make sure you um, put some neutral colors with it or some basic colors just to tone it down a little bit. Yes, if I would use this as a background for a page that would be super busy, I wouldn't do that. So I would combine it with a couple other um, colors. And then this one is actually also pretty nice, versatile. Uh, fun paper to have for backgrounds for accents so um, you know even so this might scream 70s or 80s I think 80s more um, at the beginning or it screams like oh teenagers and young at heart I think there's a lot you can um, actually get out of this paper pack when you look close up Okay, and then always remember there's artwork that gives you a little idea on what you can do. See here, Sucker Girl, isn't that pretty? Same paper pack. I mean, the hearts works great, the splashes we saw. And then tone it down with some um, neutral colors, in this case black. And it really makes the girl pop. So, um, you know, there are ways to use this other than just for your teenagers, but... I know it's sometimes hard for those ages to get a decent paper and I think that's a fun one. It And it comes just as the paper pack or with the, um, the sticker sheet. We have our matching cardstock. Then we have acrylic shapes and again these are in three to four different colors and they can be used on anything. I mean there are hearts, there are stars, there's everything included and here are smiley faces. We have our digital art collection, which is um, usable under Cricut. They come as SVG files, so when you order them, you order them like any other paper and anything. Then we have our Picture My Love cards, matching the fun paper pack. And here we have some matching um, stamp sets. So this is the one meant for scrapbooking, simply because, you know, it has a lot of lettering here. It has bigger um, symbols often that will maybe not work so well on a card, um, like this big star here. So this is a 12 by 12 layout, so you can see it's pretty big on a card, mm, might not work so well. And then this one is for card making. And again, this is kind of a fun, cute um, set for anyone, everybody. And then here's the scrapbooking workshop kit. And you will be doing um, these uh, three layouts and everything comes including instructions. You have um, the paper pack, the cardstock, you have specifically designed papers and special embellishments and they usually just pop out of the paper. You have the little acrylic shapes and you have some um, black die cuts. Um, the nice thing is, so you can follow the workshop to the teeth as it is shown here, but if you say, hey, you know what, I like this sprinkled paper, which is a specialty paper, and I put this uh, to a different use, um, and instead I use white cardstock, and I have plenty of inks and colors and paints that I can do my own splashing, be my guest, it works great. Here you have extra paper for another page. So um, if you buy the workshop, 
it guarantees you these layouts if you be a little bit creative and you like to change things up um just get the extra cardstock package that comes with every kit like here and you have plenty of cardstock to make extra pages and redesign your workshop that's what i often do now here is a fun card making workshop <laughs> and uh when you look at these and you see these old cassettes i mean oh my god this throws me back to lots of um recording on the radio in the evening when as we had like um the music charts going and you were going stir crazy when the uh reporter was you know blubbing in the middle of the song you're trying to record these days you might have to explain to kids what this is or was because many might not even know what they're looking at but i think it's a fun cool retro thing here you have a couple of phrases with it um background stamp so this one is um exclusive to this card making kit if you would like this um the stamp set and it comes with a die for the cassette um you can uh, only get this as a workshop kit and then naturally once the paper is used and everything you still have the stamp set left and that's a fun set i just love this cassette okay tutti frutti so i don't have a sample for you guys right now to show it's april and this is one of the papers that is still uh, on its way so even i haven't seen the original ones yet but it's such a cute summer paper and we can use some summer here in michigan it's getting a little droopy and snowing today again but hey, it's april what do we expect right so tutti frutti lots of ice cream cute paper um, and design um, inspiration here or for cards and here's a paper pack so again you get two sheets of each and they're double sided and you can see this one here has ice creams this has fruits here's another ice cream here you have your sunglasses you have stripes and you have polka dots so it is a good mixture um even if you don't need the ice cream or um you don't need the fruits you know you have varieties here you can switch it up it comes with a sticker sheet and with or without we have the matching cardstock we have these cute mini shapes which are great either to just attend your um your pages or your cards but it's also awesome to put into those cute shaker cards like they can see here so this is a filler a great filler here's our digital art collection again svg files so it works with every cutting machine that can handle svg files including the cricut um the new cricut machines um and as you can see here there are many different um items and even so there is like this card here compared or combined or here this card with the different glasses you can take these individually apart so uh, you don't have to make this card the way it is let's say you just want to use these middle sunglasses you can just take those out and delete the rest for now and just work with the glasses so um this all comes in one kit in one collection and just remember you have to download them but you order them like a paper pack like anything else it gives you here the number so you just put it in your shopping cart and by the end um you have to download it to your computer okay here are our um, picture my life cards so six by four and three by four and then we have matching um card making stamps and scrapbooking die as uh, stamps and dies so everything that has a pink background is a die um these are fun little borders so are these little ones and i mean you can you can do all sorts of things i mean you have, don't have to use them those could be wheels those could be lemons they could be everything um then we have um these bigger ones here for the pages and these are samples so these are cards regular uh quarter cards these are 12 by 12 pages so you get an idea how big the elements are sometimes these sets even so it says scrapbooking there are plenty of views with those on a card as well and actually the card will always work on a page because these are on a smaller scale these usually on a bigger scale um but 
uh, sometimes they will still work on a card it just depends on what set it is and um you know um how big the elements are so these are two different ones and you can always get them with the dies and without the dies and just as a reminder every stamp set that comes with a die that is in on your list of must-haves i recommend ordering it as soon as possible because the dies are limited so the sets with the dies are limited while the stamps on their own usually are longer available the stamps are made in-house here in utah and in the u.s so they can make them at any time at any point they can reproduce them if needed if they sell out the dies are once they're gone the dies are gone um usually we can't get them anymore so um then you have to fuzzy cut which often is not a big deal either um but just keep this in mind when you say hey you know my budget right now doesn't let me order order all of these that i want um pick the one that you really want or the one that has the most difficult dies in it and then um save the ones that are easier to hand cut for later and then order them and in case they're really sold out um you're not too disappointed and you know that you can handle it by die cutting them or not die cutting <laughs> fuzzy cutting them okay here's our workshop uh for the 2d fruity paper and again you're making two of these um, you're making two double page layouts these three different ones everything comes included included specialty papers and all the decorations um, you even get the tutti frutti, those little uh, things to make these shaker cards. So the acetate, everything comes with it. And I know it's not like a shaker card in a, when you have a card where you just um, uh, do your little shaker. But these elements on a page usually are more like decorative. But um, since they're really thin, they don't take up too much space or bulk in your pages. And they still give you a nice... Um, little extra that you don't see all the time and then just look at this design isn't that great with that cut in here again uh, take this design and think about putting this on a card that will work great on a card too but um, I just love how they did this in this double spread and actually I, I need those pictures because that little one I don't know whose baby that is but she's cute so you learn different techniques um different um ways of putting photos down and these workshop kits are really great and like i said before if you like to change them up a little bit because they don't fit your pictures just the right way or you think some one thing is too busy um get the extra card stock and change them up and you get even more out of them this is the matching um card making workshop and again, you get a stamp set with the dies. And there are multiple here's phrases exclusive for this set. So this is not otherwise available. And once you use them all and you make four cards, um, four different designs and four cards of each design. So 16 cards total. And once you're done with those, you're still left with um, the dies and the stems. And um, when we had our walkthrough, earlier this month um this is the wrong um card in here you're not making two of those this is a different design i don't have the current one yet um but i'm sure once the catalog goes live you will see the fourth card too so these are the three one and then this one is the wrong one then we have our mix and papers which on their own work great because they're usually more neutral um designs they're fillers they're really great for any other projects if you still have papers from let's say the sweet and honey our um sawyer um they work with a lot of the other paper packs too and they're double-sided and you get one of each and then they also have these substrips each one of them and um i just like them they work with both of the paper packs that you have seen in this catalog before but they also can stand on their own and they can also work great with any other paper pack you have from close to my heart so these are the colors and the designs 
and here's another sample where they use quite a bit of the designs but also a few of the see this is from the tutti frutti these are from the um no this is the mix and this is from um the first one what was it called yeah fresh paint i should remember this by now so um they mix all together and these are great additions then we come to our stem sets and um like always you see a little combination of multiple stems that are coming up and they did little tags with them or little addings to a page or um, a card and just gives you an idea uh, what you can do with those but above each and every stem set is also always an example either um, a page layout or cards so you know how to use them on certain things and this one is actually a six by eight um uh, layout and you can see they have the lemons here they have the uh, little um, jar and I remember there were many uh, people that were asking for the jar when we had this a while ago um, it is great to put flowers in there it is great to put if you have like um, those little cute like flies or a frog or something so there, there's a lot of things you can put inside those for christmas you could put in um candy canes you could put in um the little um, peppermints okay sorry about that um so here we go so um again these are versatile and this is a die these ones are dies, so it's a little um tag and the straw and then you have quite a few of phrases in here plus you have these cute little banners and again these can be used on cards these can be used on um, um, layouts and you can see them here they put them on some paper so they're just the right size because of this is a six by eight these are three by fours so this is four inches so you can see this is a nice size for adding on a card and then you have all these little extra ones so this is a great one and again you can have them with the dies or without and then we come to this set which is one of my favorites and i have it coming when it's not here yet so um this is called the palm front stems and you can have them with the thin cuts or just as a stem and i just love them they're decent size i mean this is a page layout of 12 by 12 so you can see they're pretty big but these are also cards so you can see how big they are on a card and i think they were great for both and you can never have too many leaves um for flowers or anything so this is one of the flowers that is actually in the um, main catalog it's a die set um it's this one here see and we have these uh, leaves and these ones that come with it it's the layered flowers but um z4324 um but i think they were great with those big ones too so they look more tropical and um then we have this set which is another one that is on its way um to me because i love these brush strokes um stem sets we had had quite a few in the past and as you have seen me throughout uh, the last two months using this one a ton because I just love them um, if you're not um, too keen on doing your own uh, splashing behind a photo or behind a title or you know just a phrase these things are great to use so as you can see here the miss you they use this one on here the um, happy birthday they use this one um, here you see those little sprinkles here. That is this one. Tahiti is another one. I think they use this one here. The bigger one. And then I don't know if they have this one on here. Maybe behind here a little bit. But these are just really great to give a little bit color um, onto something without stressing out and, you know, using a sponge some people have issues i don't want to um, see the edges of my sponge when i do this or it's just easier to use so this is a great set to have um and if you don't have one yet i highly recommend getting that one 
if you ever wonder which colors are used in these different layouts or for these different um, examples that they show you here are always the colors that give um, that work or they used up here in the examples same here so for this one the sage harbor rosemary um sorry mint harbor rosemary sage new england ivy ep, uh, avocado and sundance so a nice combination of blues and greens and a little punch of um, orange with the sundance or yellow then we have something for the beach goers well beach goers this is more beachy with all the little shells and the seahorse and again comes with and without um, bin cuts and then we have one where you can make your own beach scene you get a little um, palm the flip-flops the umbrella and the beach chair um, the head the sunglasses they're all dyes so with or without but the nice thing is so you can use it as is or you can give the chair some stripes like they did here the umbrella can be used as is or you give them some stripes like they have done here same with the hat um or the palm and then here you have your flip-flops um the nice thing too is i mean this can go in a garden this can go um watching a movie you know movie night under the stars um this doesn't have to be a beach scene this could be a picnic this could be a lot of things um it's really a nice um set to have you have the little backgrounds down to do some sand grainy sand and then like i said these ones are just adorable for any ocean any other well if you go to zoo or you ocean, um you be at the lake you still sometimes find some shells maybe not these but they would work too and then here we have something that's really cute so this is birthday stamps and birthday numbers so the numbers are thin cuts and you can see them here they're nice sized and then um, we have these for birthday cards and you have your second your um, first your thirds um, your your fourth your, your thirds um, you have all the necessary um, stamps to create one of these cards and even if you don't want to use the little mermaid or the pirate you can still use the rest on a birthday card and here are all the numbers so you can actually put together any number you want if it's 90 or if it's one year old it doesn't really matter so these are about an inch tall they're really nice then we have this a million reasons just a stamp set but with some really cute phrases and you can see here they are lovely to put on a card then we have something more for the sports uh, enthusiasts um so we have one that's called um, rollerblading and then we have bmx so every outdoors bike riding motor riding whatever you want to call it so there's a, another one of these and then we come to the card makers again and um, here are some samples of the um, stem set that you see over here this is one of the newest um, thin cuts it's called postures frames and it comes in threes and it does this really nice border outside oh you can see it here and i love these um since this is new and i don't know if this will be in the next annual book um so if you're interested in that one don't wait too long here is a beautiful stamp set um for background but i think you can also use this to create your own um background uh, papers for a scrapbook page so this is a really nice big one as you can see here and naturally you have to color it in a little bit otherwise it doesn't show um, this that set might look a little bit funky but uh, the purpose of it is that you can stamp a two-tone without you know um, um, covering up certain areas and you have to always be careful so here it says for example you are awesome so this part is stamped in one color and then it fits right on top of this one which was stamped in the pink or here for you is this one in pink and then this one fits right on top on this one in a second color so this is a nice 
um, fun stamp set to have and um, to mix and match um, these phrases with each other. So that's kind of an interesting thing. And then here we have a couple more phrases on this one. And here we have a couple more. So uh, let's look at the coffee one first. So this one comes as a thin or without, and it's called Coffee Helps Stamp. And it just has some really fun phrases on there. Today's good mood brought you to you by coffee. Uh, life happens, happens, coffee helps. Uh, strong like my coffee. There's nothing I wouldn't brew for you, or I don't need an inspirational quote, I need coffee. Well, we all can, I think, um, um, agree with this in the morning. So um, just a fun, cute little stem to give some extras on a card or, you know, when you make um, gift cards, that's a perfect way to, if you have for coffee or something, that's a great way to do. Then we have um, a stamp that's called Irish Blessings, and um, this is a great one to have. Again, if you're a card maker and you love to stamp phrases on the inside of your cards as well, these all work great on the outside. They're really great, but I would sometimes maybe put them on the inside and just put something small on the outside. Either way, this is a great set to have. We don't have those very often, and I just like what the phrases say here. Um, what do you say? May the wings of the butterfly kiss the sun and find your shoulder to light on to bring you luck, happiness, and rich today, tomorrow, and beyond. Um, so nice birthday wishes. Um, here we have a couple others. So it's a great set to have. And as you can see here, how they enhanced it with some of the brush stroke stamps that we saw earlier, just in different colors to make certain lines and words pop or just color in the little things here. So this is a great, great set to have. Then again, card makers, but you can use these also on pages. Let me explain. So we have a couple um, examples for the cards and you can see here, this is one of the sets, a small one, but it's a three by three. So it's relatively big. Here's another one that has a couple of fruits and some cute little phrases with it. And then we have these background dies. So one die cuts the leaves and they pop up and they have these little um, stitch lines in them. And then you have to put another paper behind it if you wanted to bring out uh, the design even more. And then we have this one, which is called Decorative Texture Background. It's a thin cut and it cuts these tiny little things out here. And um, this is a really nice background stamp, super easy, but I think just makes the card really quick and easy to put together and still look gorgeous. And you can um, double them and put them on a, a, a page, on a scrapbooking page as well, if you wanted to. This is a great extra design for, you know, even so we don't have a long one, but um, you can put those on there as little accents and little extra embellishments as well. So these are two dies. And in the past, our background um, thin cuts, they sold out quickly too, so if one of them is really something you want, make sure to get this ASAP. Now this is the paper pack that we saw at the beginning, at the front of the catalog, and it's called Hope and Kindness. And it is a gorgeous paper. I know it doesn't really show here as much. So let me show you a little bit of the paper because I have this paper here. Thankfully, and there are multiple things that come with this set. So let's go with the paper pack first. So the paper pack you can have um, with the sticker sheet or just the papers without. And in this case, there are twelve sheets. So six double page designs. Normally we have three, so this is the double the amount. That's why the price is a little bit different too. Here you have some really great thick stickers. 
and again they make great additions for scrapbook page as well and then these are the papers and i just like the colors they're really the color combination is really great so we have little florals here with a nice zip strip up here and then we have leaves on the background on the back side of the paper we have polka dots on this one and then you have uh, four by six cards on this one so you can cut them apart and just use them on your pages or on a card if you want to but these are great for journaling or even as photo mats or just as inspirational um, thoughts on your page um, and if you don't you have the polka dot um, design that you can use here this one has stripes and it's got some pretty sage um, that's the papaya sundance that's um, the harbor and what is the other one desert rose nectar and peach so these are all really pretty striped papers and then you have stripes on the background so you can either use them and cut them apart and use them as stripes on your or decorative stripes on your pages or um, you use them as a design element you know they're already put together for you whatever you want to do these are two of those then we have this gorgeous green design and on the back side are more in this case there are a few um four by sixes there are three by fours this one can be cut apart there are different um phrases you have some banners you have a i would say that's a four by four and a two by two so different sizes and again if you don't like those you still have this gorgeous paper paper here's a nice little flower design and on the back it's a yellow and it's a nice warm yellow so it's really great someone and we have this paper which i don't know if you can see it looks like craft paper in the background with the white daisies and then we have this full bloom on the harbor which really makes the colors pop so they look gorgeous so these are the papers that go with the set and again you get two of each double-sided and there are six of these and then this is the sticker sheet so this is the um, die cut set that comes with it so it's a whole sheet and um, it is a nice thickness and if you have not seen this let me pull one out here so these are um, the flowers and I hope you can see those these are super thin they're not as sturdy as the black ones we had but they're still very sturdy to handle but they're so delicate and so pretty and you can color these in with ink carefully you can use shimmer brushes because it is a paper form so anything you want to use on them will work you can even put stickles or um, the pearls that we had on there and they're just gorgeous so there's a whole variety there um, butterflies flowers leaves you name it and you can see how easy they pop out so this is the whole sticker sheet that comes with it, or not sticker die cuts, they still have to put adhesive on them. And then we have a specifically designed cardstock. And while this might on camera not show so great, um, let me show this. So. As you can see here this is the cardstock and it looks like there is um it's texture on it but it's it's flat but and the back side is more like a wash i just it's just really gorgeous paper then we have the green same thing textured on one side like the wash on the other and it looks like watercolor paper almost if you ever have seen watercolor paper with the little humps and bumps um this is kind of what this looks like a little bit but it's smooth it's not um uneven and you can see it's just really gorgeous here it's even a little bit better 
So that's one side and that's the wash on the other. And then we have these craft papers and here you can really see on the white stripes, see how this looks like there's little bumps everywhere, but it's not. So you have stripes on one and then you have just a plain paper on, color on the other. And then we have another set where this is just a plain, plain paper, but then this side has already made for you a nice backdrop to put pictures in and everything. And I just love it. it looks like white chalk ink or something that was put on here. So really, really gorgeous um, paper pack. And you can see this here. It's cardstock. And I really love this cardstock paper. So, and then we have this beautiful stamp set that also comes with dies. And I have that one here. So you have these flowers, the hearts, and the beautiful and the heart as a die. And it's really a nice set. There are all the dies in here. And I love these ones. You know, where you just, um, the, the letters are white, but everything else is in color. And really nice phrases. And flowers, we can never have too many flowers. And they go so well with the paper pack. And as you can see here, they color them in with markers. Uh, we can color them in with watercolor um, pencils. There's a lot we can do with these. And last but not least, these are two dies. And the fancy doilies are awesome. And let me see if I can get them out. So here. They come on this magnetic sheet. Mine is stuck in the envelope. So this is a pretty big die, as you can see. So this measures, let's see, a, almost five and three quarters in diameter so that's a pretty big one so if you wanted to use this on a card you can only use part part of it on a card and but the little one you can use as you can see here or the big ones that you only use part of it but it also works great on um a page and then this one actually fits right inside here so you could do a little multiple layers you know bump them up a little bit this is just a great die set to have and let me tell you, we have um, many of these really delicate dies um, in the program. And they work so great every time you um, get them out of the die cutting machine, the paper just falls out of them. So it's not really sticking to it or anything. It's really great. So these are the special ones for um, um, the Hope and Kind papers. And there will be a bundle, and I don't have the information here right now. Um, so there's gonna be a bundle for these papers. Let's see, I know I had one somewhere. Anyway, um, there will be a bundle where you can get the dies, um, the stem set, the paper with the stickers, um, the die cut set and the cardstock all in one big bundle for uh, a big discount. Or you can order them individually. That's up to you. But it is a very pretty paper. And again, you know, with the dies, um, if you really want one, just have a look. And if you have a friend, you maybe, because it's a big paper pack, you can even divide this and, um, you know, share uh, the item so that's up to you just as an idea but it is a great value for the paper and I love the paper there will be workshops I already have seen a couple of the workshops for the pages and for the cards super cute and as always um, once they are online available you just go to the bundle or to the workshop you want you click on the workshop and underneath each workshop uh, from Coast of My Heart is a PDF to download with the instructions and pictures of the workshop. So even if you decide, hey, I would like to follow some of it, but I do my own design otherwise, and you just get the paper pack, for example, you can follow along 
some of the workshops require certain other elements but i mean you you can work work around just if you don't have those and then we have our stamp of the month uh so this one is the one for may available may 1st to may 31st and it is just a beautiful one so i really like this one um it's got the mountains in the background it's got a mirroring image on the bottom you have clouds uh, you have little trees, you have little birds, and you have friend, love, peace. Uh, you matter in this world. It's a beautiful day to go after your dreams. You can do everything. Strength doesn't come from what you can do. It comes from, it comes from overcoming the things you once couldn't. Um, I just love the phrases too that are in here. They're so uplifting and so um, inspiring. So this is a really nice set. And again, this one works on pages, but it also works great on the cards. So I have this one already to show you. This one I have not here yet. This is the one for June. It's got all these little borders here, which are just fun. Or you cut them apart and use the um, elements individually. You can make your own background paper as you can see here they're just so cute see here they use a couple as um decorations um just a fun card uh set to have so um our stamp of the month just a reminder only available in that month so this is june and this one will be only available in may and you can purchase this for full price or if you spend fifty dollars or more you can get it for five dollars um if you're a vip member you can get this for free um if you don't know what other perks come with the vip membership um comment below or contact me and i will fill you in but it is worth it and then we have at the end still our um big smile stamp which is just so fun all these phrases perfect for card making but also great for um a little sayings on um, pages and um, seven dollars of each set will go as a pro proceed to um, operation smile which is a great cause that close to my heart is supporting now for years and that will wrap up our walkthrough um i think it got a little bit longer <laughs> i have to see if i can cut it down a little bit but um just remember so this is the last time that we have the two month catalog for now maybe they will go back one day but for now it's um the last one starting in july we will have a three month catalog and um just be aware some things might still not be available i know many almost most of the stuff is in right now um but um often that's the first shipping and then there's another one coming so depending on um how um the rush is on things um some might sell out quicker than others um just remember if you want the thin cuts make sure to order them as soon as you can make your list and check out what might work for you best and then um everything else should be available come may 1st um if not just hang in there we all have a little bit um issues with the supply chain these chains these chain these days but um i think this will work out so i hope you enjoyed the little walkthrough and um i will see you back here with a couple of um samples and um which i have to get going but the stuff just arrived two days ago too so i'm i'm eager to test them but i also have other classes to prep right now so um i will see how fast i can get something together for you in the meantime if you have questions please let me know and otherwise um i wish you happy browsing and remember we still have our current book available which is oh where is it here which is this one march april and it has some gorgeous papers in there. Um, we have the cake dots, the cake, um, cake day papers. Um, these dots are sold out, just to give you a heads up. They're still available in the workshop kits, but um, not as individuals anymore. Uh, we have great workshops 
and this is a super cute card making workshop and then we have in full bloom again super fun papers gorgeous still available also um the scrapbooking workshop kit as well as the card making the card making is gorgeous um so if you haven't seen those make sure to browse for this one you can find them online and um if you like the video please give me a thumbs up that would help me to build my um base here on youtube but it also shows youtube that you're interested in more of these videos and uh, we'll give you a couple more to choose from so thanks for watching have a great day and i will see you back here soon bye bye